Testing one, two, three, testing one, two, three, testing one, two, three.
I've got to get through this one first. Yeah. Alright, well, go well, man. Welcome to Kingsway, where Wanneroo hosts Cottesloe for round 20 of the Fortescue Premier Grade competition. I'm Damien Pacheca, and I'll be your commentator today. It's been a tough season for Wanneroo, with lots of narrow losses. Although they're sitting on the bottom of the ladder, they always have plenty to play for and show plenty of heart at home. Speaking of the ladder, we've got uh, a do-or-die game for Cottesloe today. A win today keeps them in the hunt. They're currently sitting in sixth spot on 46 points. As you can see, they've got Associates and Perth Basel just above them, three points ahead. So a win today will keep them in contention, and they're hoping for some other results to go their way so they can leapfrog into the four. Other results today, Wanneroo, third grade, 27, Cottesloe, 40. Second grade, Wanneroo, 14, Cottesloe, 45. So the Seagulls looking for a clean sweep today and finish, finish it off at the... Home of the Roo Dogs. Just waiting for Wanneroo to run onto the field now. It's a lovely day here at Kingsway. The sun's shining. Not much wind to speak of. Should be a good day for running rugby. Looks like we've got Cottesloe kicking off. Uh, running from right to left. Waiting for them to take their positions. Yeah. Referee checking there, they're both ready to go. We've got Gio Lituala kicking off. Gio's had an outstanding season, being called into the Western Force squad to tour to Bloemfontein to play the Cheetahs and in the two match se series over there and then they host the Cheetahs at home for two matches. And we're underway, kick deep down in the Wanneroo Territory. Early hit up and an offload. Taken to ground. That was Izzy, St Izzy Strickland. Ball shift in the middle. Met solidly by Pat Marker. Wanneroo looking to clear now. They send it downfield, it's not gonna find touch. Cleaned up by Robinson at the back. Shifts to Tobias Hoskins, the captain. Skipper decides to tuck it under and go for it. He's beaten three tackles. Looks at the pop pass. Doesn't go to hand, unfortunately. We've got a knock-on advantage to Wanneroo. Wanneroo popping off the ground. But we'll come back. No advantage for the knock-on. It's a good run back by Tobias Hoskins there. Beating a couple. Certainly showed some intent to run up the middle. forward to some good scrums today. Want to have an experienced pack. The front row of Tom Powell, Jake Smith and Rue McLeod. Whereas Cotters they have Cal Matenga, Mariko Nuku and Kaiser Reedy in the front row. A couple of big bodies on both sides. Whitney Lloyd defeat in for Wanneroo. Good engagement, but Cottesloe look like they've gone down on the loose head side. They have penalised. It's Cal Matenga. You see he's overextended, straight down. Whitney Lloyd finds touch just on the 22. The first line out of the game. <laughs> Looks like it's going to be Jake Smith feeding the line out. The stalwart of the club, Jake Smith. Covers all positions in the front row. Answered the SOS call to come back and play some Premier grade. 
He's been doing a fine job. He's a Wanneroo man through and through. They go to the middle, contested in the air, but taken down by number 22, Kyle Sear. Whitney Lloyd feeds his number eight. PJ Avito has a run. Backs want it now. Riley cut out to King. King taken well by Gio Lituala. Coming the same way. It's a flanker Hinkley. D just loses it there in contact. In fact, it's been a knock on by Cotterzo contesting the ball at the ruck. So it'll be a Wanneroo scrum. Cutters over looking to make amends from that previous scrum. Let me Lloyd defeat again. Solid scrum this time by Cotterslow. Ball gets fed to Riley. Riley, a bit of miscommunication with his centre there, Grattan. Ball goes to ground, but Wanneroo clean up. King's come in to play halfback. He's going to pick and go himself. Wanneroo rumbling up through the forwards. They come short side. Grattan calls the cutout pass to Bully. Billy runs down the sideline. It's offloads and intercepted by Cottesloe. Cottesloe's found his knees. Wanneroo have to release it. Wanneroo looking to exit here through a forward runner first. Strong run there. Just open up the angle so they can clear the clearing kick for Lewitwala. Doesn't find touch. King fields it. Got his full back on the inside. Puts it on the toe. He's inside the 50, looking for the 50-22. And he does so. It's a great kick by Wanneroo. No, must have been outside the 50. Kozlo played quick and sent it into touch. Wanneroo have the line out. About 12 metres in Kozlo's half. Smith the feed again. Five man line out by Wanneroo this time. They go to the back. It's overthrown. Cleaned up there by Nuku, the hooker. Taking the ground just inside Wanneroo's half. Play out the back. Leotuala. Feeds his centre. Karupoaka. Plenty of pressure on by Bully. Hoskins, midfield hit up. Good leg drive by Tobias Hoskins. Quickly, Kaiser Reedy. He's a hard man to stop. Got some momentum. Taken down. They're coming back short side. Play it at the back. The fullback's having a dart now. That's Ethan Robinson. Taken down inside the 22 now, Cottesloe. Getting a rumble on. Ball comes out, They're looking to go wide. They got some, to oh, unfortunately just knocked on by Ethan Riley, but we come back for an offside penalty. Never play there by the centre, Kameli Kurabaki. Going for touch, looking to set up their line out. Will they be looking for a drive in more here?
First line out by Cottesloe. Found at the front, uncontested by Wanneroo. They set the drive up. Balls at the back. Trying to take it right. Jake Smith's come through the middle. They've got to get rid of it now. Easton gets caught. They need a halfback to come in and shift it. Pick and go. That's Hugh Hapatz. Got to be very close. I think it's Nuku had a, had a carry there. Marco wants it. Marco carries. Got to be close. Has he got it down? No, he hasn't. Ball comes back. Shifted on. And Cottesloe's over. It's good patience there by Cottesloe. Just got the piggies involved. And they crashed over. I think it looks like it was Hugh Happers, the number five, that scored that one. Takes the scores. Cottesloe, five. Wanneroo, nil. With a kick to come. Robinson, the, the fullback, has got the kicking duties today. Fairly standard shot, almost directly in front. Knocks over the points, takes the score to 7 0. Halpert's the try scorer there has uh, been a big part of Cottesloe in the recent years. Currently working FIFO, so he's only come back into the fold the last few weeks and he's made his mark today, scoring the first try of the game. Whip Lloyd sends it into the sun. Got lost a little bit there and Cottesloe have knocked it on. The one will have an attacking opportunity on the 22 with a scrum. Good solid scrum the last time by Cottesloe. See if they can keep it up now. Whip me Lloyd to feed it in. Ball comes out. Grattan. Looking for Bully, pass is no good, goes to ground, skips into touch. Want to really let Cottesloe off there. They had a great attacking opportunity. They wanted the intent, intent to go wide, but just a poor pass there by Graden in the end. Cottesloe have the line out, the chance to clear their half. Going for a short three-man option here. Four-man, sorry. Tobias Hoskin comes in. And they go back to that man, Hoskins. Takes it clean at the back. Shift it out. Strong run by the number seven there, Moore. Taken down just outside the 22. Hoskins comes around the corner for a hit up. No one there in support. One who couldn't capitalise. Cottesloe got there just in time. Looking to clear now. Bounce pass. It's not great. It's picked up well by Eason. Sends it down, just bounces into touch. Wanneroo we'll still have some opportunities here. Still in Cottesloe's half. Smith to feed it in. Wanneroo we'll just having a little meeting. Got five men in the line out, they're saying. Rue McLeod gives the call to Jake Smith. They go to the back. Just knock, just knock forward there by Whitney Lloyd. Good pressure in the air by Cottesloe. Forced the error and the delivery from the top of the line out. It was Peter Johnston, the, the, the line out recipient in that case. Just having a little break. I think it's Rue McLeod getting some running repairs to his who's taping 
as is PJ Avito. Taping up the years, I think. is his opportunity to suck in the big ones, have some water. It's quite warm out in the sun today. So the piggies will be feeling it. Other than that first scrum, it's been very evenly matched. Cotters are having the feed this time. Easton defeated him. Colazo loose head down again, but the penalty goes against against Wanneroo. The referee's seen something on the far side. Could have gone either way that one. Colazo lucky to to get that penalty. Easton to clear. Good touch finder just outside the 22. Colors have another opportunity to strike. Going to five man option here. Bias Hoskins late to join. Find that man again in the middle, Hoskins. Down to Easton. Wrap around play by Easton. Finds Lee Tuala, taken down to midfield. Reedy has another strong carry, gets into the 22. His prop partner, Matenga, plays out the back for Eason. Ball to Robinson, doesn't go to hand, just bounces into touch. It's a good play by the Cutters low forwards, but unfortunately the ball didn't go to hand once it reached the backs. Bit of a let off for Wanneroo there. Ball stolen by Cottesloe. Tobias Hoskins up. Wrestled to the ground. Cottesloe. Unplayable. Unplayable rock. Cottesloe ball. No. Nope. Referees said it's a Wanneroo feed. St. Green going forward. Another one or a scrum. Whitney Lloyd to feed. Another solid scrum not going anywhere. Riley puts on the toe, sends it downfield. Finds some grass in the 22. Cutters let it bounce. They send it back. Excellent touch finder. Couple of metres short of halfway. A little bit of a net gain for Wanneroo. See what they can do now to, in attack. We go to the front this time. Head down nicely. Hit up there by Karangaroa, I think it was. Whitney Lloyd comes short side, finds a gap. He's away, puts it on the toe. Bully's chasing. Cotters have Robinson back. But he's taken down, gets the offload to Marker. Cotters Easton just organising his forwards. Goes to Nuku. We're looking for the clearing kick now, I think Cotters Easton's in the pocket. Easton to Easton. Plenty of time. Doesn't find touch. Riley cleans it up. 
Storts. No, it's Grattan. Now Storts. Storts got a bit of pace and some space. He's through into the 22. Needs some help and gets it in the form of Sayer. Sayer taking down 10 metres out. Whitney Lloyd. Forward hit up there by Rue McLeod. They come back short side. Pick up by PJ Avito. Looking for the offload. Does so to Whitney Lloyd. Want to find a little bit of space. Gets the offload. Gratton is over. Wanneroo hit back. Takes the score 7 5 with kick to come. Great play by, by Wanneroo. Plenty of patience. Good support play. Great little run there by Rob Stortz, the fullback. Small stature, but his little whippet got some speed, found the space. Lining up, shot at goal. As the extras takes the scores to seven all. It's been a great contest so far. Almost 20 minutes in, the scores are level. Cotters are looking to hit back here. Tuala to kick off. This goes high and deep. Plenty of time for Wanneroo. It's PJ Avito. Inside. It down. inside. They're inside the 22, so they can kick it out on the full. Oh, King wasn't expecting it, but puts it on the boot. I think it was Gradden, not King. Finds touch. 12 metres inside Cotterzo's half. The five man option. Hoskins picking where he's going to go. Referee telling him to straighten up the line out. Keep the gap. Nuku goes to the back. Not straight there. We have a Wanneroo scrum. Hoskins pleading, pleading his case, but referee didn't want to have any bar of it. I think Hoskins trying to say that Wanneroo didn't compete. It should be play on, but referee called it not straight, and they have the scrum. PJ Vito getting a little bit of attention, perhaps got a cut under that tape. Got the water coming on. Lloyd to feed the scrum. Solid engagement. Good platform, not going anywhere. Avito picks up. Tries to bump off Sterrett, but Sterrett brings him down. Good Johnston. Puts his head down, but runs straight into Nuku. Whitney Lloyd finds Riley, puts it on the boot. Too much on it though, we'll come back for a Cotazo line out on the 10 metre line. Ethan Riley, too many wheat picks this morning.
Tuku a chance to make amends for his previous throw. Very similar spot. Bit of miscommunication, Colazo line up, but it, but it turns out okay with a blistering run there by number five, Happets, the try scorer. Maka, another solid carry. Colazo gets a quick ball. Oh, great inside ball there for the 13, Kurabeka, and he's over. Colazo scored. And it's uh, Chris Easton, the, the scrum half, ended up with it. Great play there. Good pass by Jirai Mua, the number seven. He found his centre, Kurabaki, who in the end found Chris Easton and goes over. Colazo take the lead, 12-7, the kick to come. Jirai Mua, the number seven for Cottesloe, was an integral part of that. He's an ex-New Zealand under-20s representative. He's come to Cot via Melbourne and is becoming a bit of a leader into the, in the Cottesloe pack. Extras have been added by Robinson. They scores to 14-7. Whitney Lloyd to kick off. Kicks it towards the sunny side. Sits up high. Taken this time by Cottesloe. Great run by Lea Tua. Finds Matenga. Matenga taken down on halfway. Played out the back. Lea Tua again. Looking dangerous. He's jinking. He's got some space. Runs around. Gets the offload. Cottesloe taken down. Very close to the, the far touch line. Wanneroo no, 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 no. is slow to get out of there and they've been penalised. Andrew King penalised, the hands in the ruck. Referee saying ruck's already formed, not allowed to touch the ball. Of course, Andrew King wearing the 12 jersey today. Also plays flanker, so he's going to make a menace to himself at the breakdown. Darcy Eason lining up for touch. Popping the man down at Cottesloe, Darcy Eason. Won the 2023 Mr. Cot Comp at Ladies Day. As well earned, he's got a terrific dad bod, I hear. Cottesloe have a line out 10 metres out. We're set up them all again. Fine Huppets, the try score. They get them all set it. Settled, set early. Got the momentum going. Balls at the back. Nuku has got it in his hands. As all good hookers like to do. Nuku still got it. And he's over. Well worked try there by Cottesloe. No, he's not. The referee. What's the referee calling here? Not sure what he's called there, but it'll be a, a one or a scrum. Perhaps there was a knock on somewhere. Great mall set up by Cotters though. Nuku is driving it from the back. Unlucky not to get the reward there. Want to breathe a sigh of relief, but they've still got to clear their line five metres out. Wind's starting to pick up in Wanneroo's favour. Let's see, King has a hit up in midfield. Open up the angle for the backs. Too slow on, on there, no support. Cottezo on there, get the penalty. Not releasing. Just King went by himself there. His mates didn't follow him in. 
Cutters have an opportunity here to either take the points, but they're going to go for a scrum. That's what I like to see. Midfield scrum, plenty of opportunities to go either side. Unleashes potent Cutters though back line. Wind's really starting to pick up now. Easton to feed the scrum. Another solid engagement. Free kick to Wanneroo. Just trying to see what that was for. Can't quite understand Plank. what that was for. Something to do with uh, Jiraiya Jer Mua, I think. It's a good touch finder by Wanneroo. They'll have the line out just inside their half. It's the middle, boys. So it was a short arm, so Cuddleslow had the feed. Apologies. Nuku finds Hoskins at the top. Brings it down. Mua tries to throw the sidestep. It's taken by Whitney Lloyd, but still going Mua. Pick and go. I think there was nearly Falia, the winger. Eason up and under. Contestable. Well taken by the fullback, Stortz. Terrific take under pressure, Stortz. Cottesloe putting some pressure at the breakdown. Wano looking to rumble up with their forwards. Asia. Go back to Riley. Puts in the toe, won't find touch. Field at the back by Robinson. Robinson looking to counter. Breaks one tackle, two tackles. Driven to the ground by Johnston. Great tackle. Matenga, taken down again by Johnston, putting in a huge defensive effort. It's G.A. Lituolo again. <laughs> Wanneroo, fantastic defence. Gone in with a bit of a char charge there. He's on the ball league. I think it was big, against big Kaiser Reedy, going straight to ground at the, at the breakdown, conceding the penalty. Lloyd finds touch Let's go boys, be here. around the 22 metre line for Wanneroo. Great attacking opportunity here. What are they going to do? Thrown to the front. Taken down by Whitney Lloyd. A veto has a carry inside the 22. Jirai <laughs> Mua straight on the ball. Wins the penalty for Cottesloe. Let off the pressure a little bit here. Outstanding by Mua. He was straight on and strong over the ball. Held his feet. Showed the lifting motion the referee was looking for and got the reward. Cottesloe banging to touch. And they have a line out just inside their half. Looking to throw it in again. Another four man line out. Goes to Hoskins. Brings it down. Forward pass. We'll come back for a scrum. Both sides making mistakes and letting each other off easily. The Wanneroo have another roll of the dice. 
See if they can get some more points before half time. Lloyd feeds it in. Goes left side. Ball goes to ground, a bit scrappy, bit of miscommunication in the backs from Wanneroo. Lituala brings him down, tries to have a crack at it, but asks to release it from the referee. Sia. A hit back short side. Taken at pace by one of the Wanneroo forwards. Nook, uh, Avito picks it up. Lloyd, back to Vito. It's taken down. Wanneroo not really going anywhere, but they've got a penalty now. Cutterslow, hands on the ground before he, before he was going for the steal. So you've got to support your own body weight. You can't put your hands on the ground. There's certainly some intent in Cutterslow to disrupt the Wanneroo breakdown. But unfortunately, in that circumstance, they gave away the penalty. Whitney Lloyd's pointing to the sticks, wants to have a shot. Bit of a settler, takes some points away. Lacking a bit of direction in attack, so it's a good, good opportunity to get some points on. Whitney Lloyd buys a few more metres, some halfback trickery. Tough kick, about 30, 35 metres out, almost on the 15. Looks good off the boot, and splits the middle. Takes the score to Cottesloe 14, Wanneroo 10. Heading to the last five minutes of the first half. Lee Tuala to restart. Goes deep again, looking to pin Wanneroo down in that corner. Fielded by Bully. Inside to Gradden, I think it was. Gets the kick away. Not a great touch finder, but it'll do. Looker to feed the ball in. Goes to the Hoskins in the middle. Goes through his hands, but it's cleaned up. No, it was a lock, lost forward. Hoskins trying to figure out where that ball went. Disappointed with himself. Perhaps affected by the sun as it's setting over the west. Hoskins will be disappointed. He holds himself to such a high standard. Disappointed himself for making a simple error. One to pack the scrum on their defensive 10 metre line. Cutters are looking to get the shunt on. Want to match it. Ball goes to King. Looking to get a bit of width. Bully. Good pass before he gets got whacked by Philly. Stripped in the tackle. Cottezo. Tobias Hoskins pounces on it. Gets the offload. Eason backs, banks it downfield. Finds some grass. But cleaned up nicely by Riley. Who sends it into touch.
Guys will have a line out on their attacking 10 metre line. Nearly Falia absolutely found the ribs of Simi Bully just before. Bully got the pass away though. He's slow to get up, Bully. Nuku, another untidy line out. Maka this time. Wanuru rushing up, putting the pressure on. Lee Tuala shifts it out wide. Sam Beal taken down. Offload. Offload there by Mua. Looked a little bit suspect, but referee says play on. Matenga. Good hit up in the midfield. One or all over that ball. Looks like Pete Johnson got the rewards there. Straight on. More great defence by Wanneroo. Whitmiloy taps it, kicks it out, and that'll be half time. Great, great start by Cottazo scoring two tries, and Wanneroo just settling there with the penalty. Takes the half time, scores 14 10. We'll have a quick break and we'll join you for the second half.
Welcome back to Kingsway for the second half of the round 20 Fortescue battle between Wanneroo and Cottesloe. As we're waiting to kick off, I'll just go quickly score around the grounds. Palmyra 22, leading Southern Lions 0. Nedlands 3, Associates 16. West 14, Calamunda 7. And UWA leading Perth Bayswater 25 to 10. We've got Whitby Lloyd to kick off here for the second half. Short kick. Fielded by Cottesloe. Puppets. Finds Mua. Mua still going. Great one by Mua. He's got some toe for a flanker. Hasn't got much support with him. Gets the offload, but only finds Whitney Lloyd of Wanneroo. Puts the counter. Simi Buller taken down. No one there with him. Lee Tuala's on it. Secured the turnover. Cottesloe ball. Tobias Hoskins plays out the back. Spots some space, but finds the fullback, Stortz. Wanneroo puts on the toe again. Playing a bit, bit of kick tennis out there. Eason, got plenty of work to do. Taking the ground. Does enough. Cottesloe Cavalry arrive. Playing down the short side. Ran out of room. Kicked into touch by Huppets. Great pressure by Wanneroo. Chasing the kick. Putting the pressure on Eason and forced the error. Great start by Wanneroo. Smith to throw it in. Goes to the front. Riley had to reach for it, but he's done well, but knocks it on. Nuku picks it up. Want to reflating the breakdown. Wanna, referee says he'll come back for the knock on. Taking their time to set the scrum up. Scrum half, Chris Easton. Feed the ball in. Another great scrum. Not going anywhere. Solid platform. Easton. Kicks it downfield. Finds some grass. Looking for the 50-22. Doesn't get there. Cleaned up by Stortz. Charge down. Want to have the line out just inside their 22. Want to look to clear their 22 here. Got to win the line out first. Jake Smith throw it in. Stolen by Tobias Hoskins at the Top of the line out, tap back towards Cottesloe. Cleaned up by Eason. Easton comes in, feeds Hoskins. Reedy coming around the corner. Bumps off one. Taken down just outside the 22. Nuku takes it in, into the 22. Bull looking run. Come back short side. Mua. Still going Mua. Been a handful today. Played out the back. Litoua's got plenty of work to do. Gets the offload. Finds Kuri Yabaki. Goes in. Scores the first try of the second half. Referees double tap. Confirm with his assistant. Try is awarded. Great play by Jirai Mua again. Been unstoppable so far for, for Cottesloe. As is Lua Tualo set up that try. 
made something from nothing there. Daniel Grace running the tee for Cottesloe, buttering up the referee, giving him some water. Perhaps offering some advice to Ethan Robinson. Who doesn't need it as he knocks over the extras. making their way back to halfway. Whitby Lloyd sends it down. Deep into Cutters Lowe's 22. Easton puts on the boot. Dribbles into touch. Want to have a line out just inside their half, their attacking half. Cloud gives the call to Smith. Miscommunication again, but cleaned up by Nuku. Nuku's going. Charging run. Big run by Nuku. Cottezo on the front foot. Reedy plays it out the back. Litoala. Jinx. Left foot step. Cottezo coming around the corner. Playing the same way. Looking to spread it wide. It's a good leg drive. Wanner on it, but just lost it. Marker. Tucks it under his wing. Strong run by Marker. Litoala, first receiver. Finds Nuku. Been great today, Nuku. Some very strong carries. Huppets finds his way into the 22. Lee Tuala finds the gap, gets the offload. Robinson taken down. Wanneroo trying to counter. Cotters, I still have it. Mua gets it. Somehow finds Tobias Hoskins, who runs in and dots it down. A little bit of a celebration there by Hoskins. Cutters will extend their lead. Coach Ryan Westway must have had some stern words with Cottesloe at half time. They've come out firing in the second half. Two unanswered tries. Wanneroo looking to make a change. Turagava's coming on. Number 20. Haven't seen who he's replacing yet. Robinson lining up for goal. Knocks it over again. Looks like it's uh, Izzy Strickland, the winger coming off for Turagawa. Whitney Lloyd to restart again. Plenty of time. Shifts it off to Easton. Puts on the boot. A veto from the back fence. Taken well by Lituala. Wanneroo Cavalry arrive. Smith playing half back. No. King picks and goes. Another pick and go. Riley looks a darting kick through the Filia. He's been quiet so far. Shifts it. Eason sends it down. Finds some grass. Bully to clean it up. 
He's got his full back there with him, Stortz. Decides to put on the boot himself. Had plenty of time, doesn't find touch. Robinson, counter attack. Puts a step in. Taken down. No, still going, Robinson. Still going. Into the 22. Bully wraps him up. Lee Tuala. Again, beats multiple defenders. Taken down inside the 22. Looking to come the same way. Reedy wants it. Doesn't get it. It's there to clean out. Nuku comes in to play scrum half. Is he going to pick and go himself? Yes, he does. Taken down. Eason hits back. Mua. Inside ball. Falia bumps off one. Still going Falia. Just short. Forward settling here. Ball shifted to Marker. Marker. Has he got there? Held up. We're going to come back for a penalty though. A little bit of uh, argy-bargy going on down there. Marker doesn't like how he's been treated. Wanneroo trying to stir him up a little bit. Tobias Hoskins saying calm down. Mua looking to tap. Marco Matenga, either side of him, which way is he going to go? Looking for the tap. And it's all for nothing. What are they doing? Oh, referee was just talking to his assistant. Now he's having a chat to Wanneroo. And they're going to go for touch. I think Cotters are going to go for a drive here. Tobias Hoskins walks into the line out. They go to the front, get the drive set. Got the ball to the back, driving around the corner. It's been st stolen by Wanneroo. Excellent ball defence by Wanneroo. Riley clears it down. But Cotterzo still have an opportunity inside their 22 with an attacking line out. Not sure how Wanneroo ended up with the ball out of that mall. But they did. The referee said it was legal. Cotterzo making some changes. Come on. Sualu, Phil Sualu has come on. Number 19. And we've got a new man at, at 10. Who gets it now? That's Meredith. Ben Meredith, number 23. Hoskins. Decoy runner was hit as well. Hoskins brought the ground. Reedy shifts the ball on. Got good skills to the big man, Reedy. Mua again. Offload by Matenga, taken down. Lee Tuala, first receiver, Maka. Fights the ground, Maka. Wanneroo got their hands all over it. Lee Tuala again. Hoskins shifts it on to the new man, number 19, Sawalu. Ball comes out, taken down. That's the winger, Veal. Hasn't had much of the ball today. But ping for holding on. Nope, Cottesloe off their feet at the breakdown. Again, Cottesloe, simple mistakes, letting them down. They've had plenty of opportunity. 
Wanneroo's defence has stood it up. Whitney Lloyd bangs into touch. Wanneroo have a line out on their attacking 10 metre line. Smith defeated again. Finds Hinkley. Riley spots a gap. Good run by Riley, but hasn't got anyone with him. Cottesloe almost steal it there. Smith having a run. Gets the offload. Hinkley. Hinkley, the flanker, hits back. Excellent try against play by Wanneroo. Great defence, gets some reward with a try to Wanneroo, taking the scores. Got us like 28, Wanneroo 15. Excellent run by Jake Smith, winding the clock back. Wanneroo veteran. Great support play by Darcy Hinckley. Lloyd to line up for the extras. Lloyd's just sprayed it. Score remains 28-15. Cutters are looking to regroup and hit back. Give him one or a sniff here. Cutters are not in a hurry to restart. Taking the extra few moments to compose themselves. Smith gets some running repairs from Wanneroo. Tuala looking to restart, looking towards the sunny side again. Goes deep. Taken by Vito. Caught the ball at pace. Cottesloe, front the breakdown. Counter up. But we just found touch. Great counter up by Cottesloe. Since the numbers in, saw the opportunity. Unfortunately, the ball just found its way into touch. But it came off one row, so it'll be a cutter's low feed. <coughs> Finds Marco at the front. Meredith beats one, beats two. Meredith bounces space. Unfortunately, the offload probably from a Wanneroo player calling for it. Karen Garoa intercepted it. Wanneroo rumbling up through the forwards. Buying a bit of time for the backs to get back into position. But stuffing around with it too much. Mua, quick tap. Tries to catch him napping. Is he over? Wanneroo is saying he's knocked it on. What's the referee going to say? Wants to talk to his assistant. Andrew King from Wanneroo certainly knocked it on. Miller's been outstanding today. Deserves the try. Referee's deliberating. Keeping us all in suspense. Looks like it's no try. But they went back they went back ten, so we'll have the penalty again. Colors are electing for the scrum.
Shortly, it's Wilder and Robinson on the short side. Plenty of space for him. And Flea, but penalty. Wanneroo scrum earns the penalty. Cotters though ping for dropping their bind, it looks like. And the referee signals. Whip me, Lloyd. To relieve the pressure with the kick. Not the greatest touch finder, but Wanneroo still have the line out feed. Go to the middle, plenty of pressure by Hoskins, but taken down nicely by Wanneroo. Kyle Sear took it down. Whitby Lloyd had a dart himself, needed a half back. McLeod, the prop, feeds it to, sorry, McLeod receives the ball, has a hit up. Wanneroo not really going anywhere, Cottesloe rushing up in defence. Riley decides to put the little kick in. Hoskins lets it bounce, Fulia picks it up, just taken by the bootlace, but gets up and goes again. Referee is saying is held. Unlucky to Nilly Fulia, but referee said it was enough, enough to hold him, hold him down. Had one boot. Some piggyback penalties against Cottesloe. Given Wanneroo some good field position. Stopped again for another another injury. I think it's Huppets from Cottesloe, seems to be okay. As though coach Ryan Westaway pacing the sideline. Means so much for Cottesloe to get the win today. Smith throw the line out in. They go to the back. Taken cleanly. Whitby Lloyd feeds the back line. Evito. Continue going right. Big looping pass to Bully. Shut down, nowhere to run. See ya. Avito, another run. Such a strong ball carry for Wanneroo, PJ Avito. Play at the back. Riley tucks it under. Skips through Tobias Hossen's tackle. Cottesloe on the ball there. Unlucky. Huppets. Avito, another run. Trying to lift his team. Great leg drive. Goes into 22. King. Unfortunately just knocked on there by Wanneroo, but Cottesloe looking for the counter attack. They put the ball in the boot. No one at home. Oh, unfortunate bounce, but it's bounced back up into Cottesloe's hands. And they're away. Chris Eason scores a try. Big run against play. Really hurt Wanneroo that one. They look to be in control. But that's rugby. can turn so quickly. Making a change, young Tom Crofts coming on, 17 year old. <laughs> Extras have been added. Takes the scores 35 15.
Had some changes in the Cottesloe front row. Number two, Mikey Walker's come on. Kaiser Reedy. Had a big shift today, Kaiser. It's lots of strong carries. Also, Paul Durham coming on, number 20 for Cottesloe. For Mua. Mua's been outstanding today. Well deserved rest. Braden restarts, finds Marker, runs in field, still going. Apologies, not Marker, just the centre, Kuribaki. Sawalu has a hit up, sends it back to Meredith, puts on the boot, finds Stortz, Stortz looking for counter. Taken down just inside Cottesloe half. Cottesloe on the ball. Wanneroo just get there in time. Cottesloe meeting Wanneroo, driving him back. Avito passes to no one, bounce, bounces up and bullies hands. Good counter ruck by Cottesloe. Centre field run by the prop pal. Riley tucks under his arm again. Cotters on the ball. Just lose it. Not much on. The kick goes on, on the boot by Sia. Not a notable kicker, but decided that was the option. We got a more, more form by Cotters though. Let off for Wanneroo. I don't think that kick was the right option, but they did well to hold up Cottesloe and then win the scrum for unplayable. <coughs> no, he's had a word to the assistant. sure what they're saying but I think it might have been a knock on in there somewhere and it's now a Cottesloe scrum. See if any if the replacements have uh, changed the dynamic of the scrum here. Mikey Walker's gone to loose head. And Matenga swapped over to tight head. Good scrum by Wanneroo, and they win the penalty. Cottesloe just hinging. I think it goes against the new man, Mikey Walker. Wanneroo banging the touch. They'll have a line out just outside the 22. Wanneroo need to be next to score if there's any chance of winning this game. Smith finds Sia. Ball comes back to Smith as they form the mall. Got some good momentum going. Into the 22 now. Still going. Smith's driving the bus at the back. Still going. Great drive by Wanneroo. Can they go all the way? Smith still pushing him along. Use it now. He splinters off. He's taken down. Crofts. Feeds Hinkley. I think he's taken high. Referee's got advantage. Hinkley just taken high. Excellent more by Wanneroo. Not often you see them all driven, driven 15 metres. Experience of Jake Smith at the back driving it. Knew when to split off as they started to lose momentum. 
referee having a word to Cottesloe skip it to Lars Hoskins as he puts his boot back on. A few Cottesloe bodies down. Mariko Nuku, the hooker, also down. Mariko Nuku, the hooker for Cottesloe. He's very versatile, plays prop as well from Auckland. And he's an engineer and very intelligent. And where's the number 17 jersey? Because he's too large for number two, which makes sense. Electing for the scrum. Love to see a push over here. Young Cross to feed the ball in. Referee not happy with something, so blows it up. Well, go, go for a reset. Trap Marika Nuku is, is playing at prop, tight head. Mikey Walker's at hooker. So dominant in the previous scrum, Wanneroo looking to continue that dominance. Good engagement. Cottesloe, good defence. Riley goes himself. Forwards come, looking for some pick and goes. And they've got to try. Wanneroo hit back. Just trying to see who it was. I think it was one of the props. M big, massive bodies. I'm not sure who the, who the try scorer was, but Cottesloe still leading 35 20. Still 13 minutes to go. Got a Wanneroo injury down as well. Not looking good. Grattan's taken over the kicking duties. and just pushes it to the left. No! Scores remain 35-20. One of the players still down on the try line. Referee just walking over to see what's going on. Still receiving some attention. I'm not sure who's down, but referee saying play is going to continue. Looks to be quite a serious injury. The assistant referee is still down there, so play is still halted. Just use this opportunity to go around the grounds, get some score updates. Palmyra leading Southern Lions 34-5. Nedlands trailing Associates 3-33. to West Scarborough 45, Calamunda 7. Close one at the library, UWA 28, Perth Bayswater 27. Very interesting game there between UWA and Basie. Perth Bayswater in the hunt for the finals. Much like Cotter's eye, need to get the win and associates. So it looks like all three of those teams. So Cotter's eye and associates look like they're looking.
good for the, their run for the four. So it looks like it's a serious injury, so play play stopped for a little while. I'll take a short break and I'll join you back once the scores once the injury has been resolved. Honorary players just leaving the field now. We'll resume play. Taken by Vito. Probably been their best today, Vito. Very strong carries. Crofts. Fires back. Kick down field by Wanneroo. Taken by Lee Tuala. Mikey Walker has a run. Ball spills out the back, cleaned up by Wanneroo. Counter up by Cottesloe. Did he come in from the, the side? Yes, he did. Referee's got his arm out, penalty advantage. Wanneroo making a break down the wing to Regawa. Taking down a bit of hands in the ruck by Cottesloe. Decided to leave it alone. Crofts. Turagara puts on the boot. Finds some grass. Clean up there by Cottesloe. Looking for the kick but thinks twice. Taken by Bully. Cottesloe regrouping. Eason puts on the boot. Crofts fires it in. Quick throw. Storts. Got Tahu. Tahu met solidly. Cottesloe on the ball there. And they've won the penalty. Straight in on the ball. Number 20, Paul Derham. Replacement player for Cottesloe. Straight in. Had every right to the ball. Kept his body position. Won the penalty for Cottesloe. as they're slowly making their way to the, the line out. Nuku still throwing the ball in, even though he swapped over to prop. Finds Marker at the front. Brings it down. Hinkley, was he onside? And it went knocked backwards, the referee says. No. Got the call from his assistant, offside. The line out wasn't over, he's not allowed to cross the, the middle of the line out. Hinkley, eyes lit up, but it's too good to be true. Carter's way have another attacking opportunity just outside the 22.
Goes to Marco again. Ball comes down this time. Meredith. Finds Derham. Quick ball. Hoskins. Shifts it off. It's taken down on the 22. They come back. Durham again. Shifts off to Sawalu. Sawalu taken down inside the 22. Quick ball again. Lila Wallace. Switch sides. Meredith. Dancing around. Puts the fend on. They go left. Sawalu again. Going side to side a little bit here. Felt as though make the break. Marker. Taken down just short of the line. Ball spills out. Want to have it, have it there. Bully. Places the ball back. Want to looking to clear. Crofts. Backs don't want it yet. Another hit up for the forwards. This time Crofts goes back to Turagawa. Doesn't find touch. Robinson. Makes his way to the 22. Skips past his opposite number. Robinson still going. But we've got a whistle. Very soft whistle. I didn't hear it. Robinson didn't hear it either. But we're coming back. For a line out. If he steps into touch. That marker. Making his way off the field. Placed by number 22, Letchford. Miles Letchford. Mark has been impressive today. He's Western Force Academy player. Come over from Canberra Vikings. He's one to watch for the future. Looks like he's holding his ribs, so hopefully nothing serious. Got a Wanneroo player down by the post as well. A very physical game today. There's going to be some sore bodies tomorrow. Probably still over 10 minutes to go with that long injury stoppage. PJ Avito getting some attention. Hopefully, he can continue going. He's been instrumental today for Wanneroo. Just give you some more score updates. Palmyra still leading 39 5 against Southern Lions. Nedlin scored a few points, but still trailing Associates 33-17. No score different, no, no score change at Bennett Park. West Scarborough still 45, Calamunda 7. Still only one point in it. UWA leading Perth Bayswater 31-30. We'll come back to Kingsway and Crofts to feed the scrum for Wanneroo. Wanneroo get the fellas are getting the shunt on, but both teams have gone down. We'll have a scrum reset. It's good engagement by Cottesloe. Trying to put the pressure on Wanneroo. Wanneroo probably had the edge in the scrum so far today. Good engagement. Cottesloe putting the pressure on. Ball comes out. No penalty. What? Not driving straight. 
penalty against Mikey Walker on the loose head side. Want to have the line out on their attacking 10 metre line. Smith throws it in, finds Hinkley. Crofts to Regawa. King had to reach for it. So it's Grattan, apologies. <coughs> Falia, excellent tackle, got to his feet. Great strength by Nili Falia. Got to get the penalty there for not releasing because he picked up ball and player. Nili Falia, outstanding strength. Good to see Nilly Falia back in. His first game back in first grade after a few years, after doing his ACL two years ago. A big part of the Cottesloe's Premiership run a few years ago. And great to see him back in the fold. Also a former Perth Spirit representative in the, the defunct National Rugby Championship. Cottesloe have the line out. Go to Hoskins, taken down, but not cleanly. Wanneroo really pounce on, on him. Need the halfback, Easton gets taken in. Hoskins just drops it. Another mistake, letting Wanneroo off the hook. And referee blows full time. Cutters though, keep their finals chances alive. Winning 35 20. Thank you for tuning in today. I'm Damien Pacheco, and we hope to see you next week. Thank you.